glasses. My reading glasses. Where? I think I'm on my nightstand. What's this right here? It's not on. Okay. The animal print one, I think it's on my nightstand. Somebody's here. Hey, Janine. Welcome. Why am I reflecting on my glasses? Welcome, sis. Now, let me go get my glasses because I can barely see. Janine is here. Hmm? Somebody else is here. I know. I missed you guys, too. I missed it. Ooh, what's with the glasses? I can't see nothing. I miss you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. My glasses are foggy. So let me wipe it off. So wipe off the glasses. So how have you been? Oof. Remy, you might have to. Good. You might have to. Hi, St. John Lover. Welcome. This light is so bright. Oh, sorry. I can barely see the screen. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Oh, God, no, I can't see nothing. Let me see. Yeah. Yeah, this is way better. We're better. Trying to clean my glasses, guys. I missed you guys. Long time no see. Trying to ouch. I'm trying to see. All right, here we go. Oh my God, this. I like my other tripod better. This one reflects a lot. But it's okay. Do this. Uh, when I get my glasses, this is what I do. Double glasses. Double. And I have to read and see you guys, so that's not working. Maybe I could turn it this way. Maybe this way. And then I must still be making that noise. <laughs> you try to see what's in the right here. It's really nothing. I don't. I, I don't know if I have any luxury. It's been so long. I didn't even. I didn't look for luxury. What's on the right? What's on the table is a Halston. It's a Halston bag. Still luxury though, but affordable luxury. That's what's on there. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. It's been a minute. I think I lost my mojo. <laughs> I really do. I don't know if I still have the mojo. Once you stop doing something, you lose your mojo. I lost my mojo. I hope I can get it back. In this light, I should turn it off. You think I need it? It's, it's making me not see. 
Waste what? Okay. All right. I think that's kind of good. I know. I had to turn off my light. It was so bright. I couldn't see. But now it's so dark, Remy. Should we put it back on? I think I could just squid. I can squid, squid, squid. Yeah, the mojo need the mojo needs to come back. Saint John Love, I haven't seen you for a minute. I saw your comment about me not doing variety. Girl, like I said, I lost my mojo. So I'm just I'm just trying to get it back. How do you reduce the thingy? Okay, okay, yeah, perfect. Perfect, Mundo. I hope everybody is well. Valentine's Day is coming. You guys have any Valentine's Day? plans because I don't it's an everyday for me oh thank good 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 traveling is good yeah thumbs up when you're coming in guys traveling is always good I want to travel too but I have to plan it so Remy could travel with me Yeah. Oh, that's you. Oh, don't do that. Jeez. Crack your neck. My, I get chills. I get chills. I'm just waiting for some people to come in. Just some liquidation today is what we're going to do. I, all right, go close that door, Remy. Please. I thought he was sleeping. I'm gonna call the people in the white to go and get him. This is crazy. Can somebody come in? No. Okay. Okay. How many people are in the house right now? Thirteen. Fifteen? Thirteen. Thirteen. I only saw. Why is my chair moving? I only saw two people so far. Two people said hi. Who are the other? Who are the other people? Who are the other eleven people? Oh, yeah. Why is my chair doing this? Why is my chair swiveling? <laughs> oh my Jesus! Stay put. Okay, stay. What she said? Am I gonna buy? Are you gonna have a buy one get one or something today? What you got? You gotta get rid of a lot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me tell you what I'm doing. When it comes to the handbags, I have a, I have a twenty dollar bean, and I have a thirty dollar bean for handbags, and then clothing, I have some five dollar bean for clothing and ten dollar bean, so. Is that good enough? I don't know about buy one, get one free. I mean, if that's if you think that's what we should do, but I think that's gonna become like a pain in the you know what. Trying to have somebody trying to get the free stuff and then this is like too much. I would rather donate. <laughs> I'm serious. I don't have the energy. But I have a little bag for five dollars for clothing. And then I have the ten dollar ones that are hanging over here. 
Then I have two beans. Oh, buy one for something. No, I have a bean, uh, a handbag bean for maybe uh, fifteen to twenty dollars for this handbag bean right here. Then I have another bean that's from twenty-five to thirty dollars for handbags because I do have a lot. You ain't lying. I got a lot. And then we have the new items, but I don't know if we're going to have a chance to do the new items today. I don't know. And we got, still got jewelry. Valentine's, Valentine's Day. Nice little. We still got those our little CC jewelry. We got some of the stainless steel and some of the regular ones. I just feel like it's Valentine's Day. People might want to give little gifts, like you know, like the stainless steel, the GGs. If I don't have the CC, I have those. So pretty much what I'm trying to do. Like I say, I've lost my mojo, but I'm I'm trying. Hopefully, it will come back. Like Janine said, little by little. I get my mojo back. We shall see. And oh yeah, and I have a couple of shoes. So, how many people, Remy? Before I start this, still? I thought it was thirteen. It was. Yeah, oh, it's two people. Yes, yeah, goes like yeah. peace out. <laughs> she ain't doing nothing yet. Where's all my sisters? Where you? Where you guys at? Huh? Did they not get my notification? I did it on both channels. But I told them to come to this. <laughs> That's what I'm hoping. After today, let's get that mojo back. So, but, you know, they like like I tell everybody, if you see anything in the store... In the boutique, even if I didn't show you, you can always, you can always ask for it. I'm going to show some of them tote bags on the floor. Major tote. Who is that? Ricardo. Yeah. Ricardo says, voila. Voila. Ricardo. I see you. You're always giving me a hard time on the comments. How are you doing, Ricardo? Huh? Are we going to be good today? <laughs> welcome, by the way. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing? Hope you're on your best behavior, behavior today. I've been seeing my comments, and then Ricardo always got something smart to say. Hey, Vicky. Welcome. Hi, Deanna Smith. Welcome. Deanna says, hello, Remy. Hello. He's like, hello. I know. The sisters are finally coming in. I'll be like, wait a minute. Where are my sisters at? I see them coming in. Hi everyone, welcome, 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 welcome. So, how many people, mister? 18. How many do we usually start? Huh? 20 something. 20 something? Well, I ain't gonna wait. It is what it is, we can start. Let me go bring the, the big old, let me know who comes in, Remy. Let me get this bag of liquidation of clothing. Oh, Lordy. I don't even know if I can carry this thing. Ricardo said OOTD. Huh? Ricardo said OOTD. You want my OOTD, Ricardo? Why? Hold on, I'll show you. 
You better know how to sell a smart to say either. <laughs> you want my OOTD, Ricardo? You're always asking for something. All right, so I have this bomber jacket from Nostrums only because it's cold in this garage. And then I have my Italian vintage sweater that we thrifted. Cargo pants I got for Marshalls. And my Vince Camuto boots. And my H baseball hat. And we got some pearl earrings. And some, I know you don't like the beads, Ricardo, but guess what? I have to wear those beads. So, and we have this. So here's my OOTD. You like what you see? <laughs> He's always giving me a hard time. But I like you, Ricardo. You're, you're always watching. Thank you for watching. So that's my OOTD. And, um... We're about to start this. <laughs> well, thank you. Yay. I put colors because I was looking mighty drabby, just wearing all black. I was like, oh, I need a future, something. And it's my vintage Italian sweater. So how many people are there? So guys. 19. Jesus. Just that? Yeah. Can we at least reach 20? Well, we're going to start. Forget it. So, guys, it's a liquidation day today. If you're new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. This is a live sale channel. Oh, thank you, Janine. This is a live sale channel. We do sell pre-love items and brand new items. So, if you're new here, that's what we're all about. We do have two channels, though. There's another channel that's just all my shenanigans. But this is just live sale, thrifted, the, you know. That's what this channel is. It's my smaller channel, but it's growing. Thank you for all of you that subscribe. I appreciate you. Uh, yay! But anyway, we're going to start today. We're going to do some liquidation. I have a lot of handbags I want to liquidate. Pre-loved. We're liquidating pre-love bags, not, not the ones on the shelves. Those are brand new. But if you see anything on the shelf you want, you can ask. And this is how it works. I'm going to show a bag. I'm going to call a number or a letter. And if you want that item, please, the first person that types that number or letter is who gets the item. We don't do... They know their ways, so be sure you want to pay for this item before you ask for it. Being that it's liquidation, I would prefer everybody pay for their items no later than tomorrow 12. T tomorrow, 12, yeah, 12 p.m. Not a.m., 12 p.m. And um, I take Venmo, Cash App, PayPal, and Zelle. PayPal is a little tricky because they be charging me a lot of money. So if you want to sell me, that's fine. <laughs> but all my payment methods are going to be up on the live sale. I think Remy already put that up there. And my email address. So if you have any questions, you can always email me. And number two, if you buy something and you're new here, even if you're not new here, guys, please, I need your address. Because some of you guys, I have your information, but it's so far back on my email that I have to search for a long time for your stuff to come up. So if you buy something today and when you send your payment, please email me your address. Please, please, please. Por favor. Um, my next, um, yeah, what else do I, what am I missing? Oh, we do mail by USPS. I only do priority and ground advantage. Those two ways of shipping are insured. So in case the mailman mistakenly give your package to your next door neighbor and your next door neighbor did not give it to you, they will pay me and I'll reimburse you. But if they mailed it to your house and it gets somebody steals it at your front door or your mailbox, they ain't going to pay me, so we're not responsible. But if you don't get your package and it's USPS fault, 
They'll pay me and I'll pay you back. Those I, that's why I use priority and ground advantage. Priority takes three to four business days. Ground advantage takes three to six business days. Same thing. I don't do regular shipping because it's going to take forever and it's not insured. I want you to get your package. So I'm doing priority and ground advantage. So, yeah. I don't know if I'm missing anything else. Oh, there is no returns. Every sale here is final. Every item you buy, before you buy it, please, please make sure you really want it because I don't want you to ask for it and then you change your mind while you're sitting at home and say, oh, no, I'm not going to buy it after you've asked for it. See, if you do that to me twice, next time when you want something, I'm not going to give it to you. So I want to make sure that, make sure you really want what you ask for because if you keep me hanging, I'm going to not sell to you no more. Okay. That's just how it is because it's happened a lot. People will ask for stuff and I'm trying to ship stuff and I'm looking for their payment and there is no payment. It's like, I think people, they sit back and say, oh, I changed my mind. And if you change your mind, please email me before the end of the day that I changed my mind so I would know not to be looking for your payment. And like I said, all sales are final. We don't do no returns, no exchanges. Final sale. We're not a department store. We're just a little garage boutique. So we don't have time to be doing the returns and the exchanges. Even big stores don't do returns anymore after 30 days. Nostrums who used to take back everything, now they don't want to anymore. It's like everybody's getting smart. So please, please be sure that you want something before you ask for it. And I'm going to need your name, not your social media name, your real name when I'm shipping to you because I know we all have these weird names on social media, but then when I'm shipping to you, I'll be like, do I write this strange name or do I write the person's name? So please give me your government name. If you want to put your social media name in parentheses, that's fine. So I know who is who. I like to know my customers by their real name. I mean... It's okay that we have all these fancy names, but real name is very personal. So I think that's that. Enough of my lecturing and talking or introduction or whatever, however you want to call this. Let's begin the sale. So, guys, let me know. Should I start with the handbags or the $5 clothing? Because, oh, the vintage, I might show some of the vintage pieces too, even though they're not a liquidation, but being that they knew, some people like these vintage sweaters and, and jackets. I might show a couple of those. So where should I start? I need, a, I need you guys to let me know. Do we do the $5, $10 pre-love clothing? Or should we do the vintage pieces or should we start with the handbags? I think the handbags, I don't know. But it's up to you. Can you all give me your give me your opinion before I start? Ricardo, Ricardo say handbags. Linda Williams says handbag. Linda Williams. I know of, I know a Linda Williams. Okay. Hmm. Okay, two people say handbags. Margaret says handbags. All right. Janine, what say you? I don't hear you. Oh, you're from Philadelphia. Okay. All right. And Linda Williams that I know went to school with me. You know, I was thinking that. But, you know, I was thinking, let's do the clothing because handbags always seem to drain me. And people are always asking, do you still have this bag, that bag? But just to keep it lively, Janine, I think I will do, I will start with the, the 15 to $20 bean handbags. And then I will do some clothing. And then I will go to the um, 25 and $30 bean so we can... I don't want people to get all tired like, oh, I don't want no damn clothes. I'm out of here. Or people say, I don't want no bags. I just want some pieces. So I am going to, let's start with the 15 to 
$20 pre-love bags. That's what we're going to do. I'm trying to pull the bean. Let me pull the bean next to me. Yeah. Because some people are so short-tempered. They'll be like, oh, I don't want to see no bags. Move your foot, ready. All right. I got a big old bean of handbags here. So we are going to start. Bag number one. Hold on, people. I want to make it look presentable. Let me get, I have some tissue here. Macy Miller says hi. Who? Macy Miller. Massey Miller? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, hi. Welcome. Hi, Massey. Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's been a minute. All right. Bag number one is this beautiful Zara bag with studs. This is Zara, bag number one. $15, gotta go. It got one handle and then I, I, I don't think, it feels like leather, but I think it's full leather is Zara. It's a beautiful tote with ringlets for fifteen dollars. Let me show you the inside. It says Zara woman right there and the inside it has a zipper Actually, it's just a slip pocket. And then it has two media pockets. The inside is nice and clean. $15 for Zara. Beautiful tote. With just one handle. $15 for Zara. All right, bag number two is this, um, Bloomingdale's snake skin bag. Special label for Bloomingdale's. Somebody say something, Remy. No, they just, um, mom, Jim said mom wants it. Oh, see, the, the Zara bag. Yeah. All right, let me pay attention for me because I am going. Yay, thanks, Miss Emma. Bag number one. What are you typing? You're not doing your homework, are you? Mm -hmm. okay. Bag number one for Miss Emma. Bag number two, we have a Bloomingdale's tote. Yeah, yeah it was the first one, the Zara one. I got it for you, Jenny. I got it for your mom. Thank you, Miss Emma. I already gave her a bell. This snake skin. Beautiful. Bloomingdale's tote exclusively for Bloomingdale's only. It's an empty tote, but it's like an embossed snake skin. And this too is $15. Gotta go. Don't put it there because I'm trying to liquidate. Thank you. Yes. Beautiful. Bag number three is this bowling bag by Cynthia Raleigh. It's a little vintage looking. If you're familiar with Cynthia Raleigh, it's beautiful with two pockets nice soft leather bags in the Raleigh small for bowler with two handles $20 for leather Cynthia Raleigh bag designer $20 for Cynthia Raleigh oh I forgot to show you the inside let me show you guys the inside it has a a zipper pocket. This bag at one point was selling for $109. I don't know if somebody wrote it on there. 
It has a zipper pocket and two media pockets. It's pre-loved, so it's not trash. It's the color, it says Cynthia Raleigh all around it. Cynthia Raleigh makes good clothing, $20. Hi, Mona, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Bag number four. four. A B. Makowski crossbody snake skin. This bag has been here forever. But it's B. Makowski. It's kind of metallic leather snake skin. See the shine to it? B. Makowski makes great leather. The inside is animal print. Crossbody. $15 for B. Makowski. $15. Got to go. Got to get up out of here. Oh, no. This is in the wrong section. This is the $30 section. Sorry, guys. Wrong section. Bag number five. five. This beautiful Francisco Basia leather bag with a woven handle. Almost look like a Silverado. On the outside zipper pocket. Francisco Basia. Designed in Italy. I think made in um, Portugal. Francisco Basia right here. This bag is $20. Gorgeous shoulder bag, $20. Bag number six. Bag number six. We got a beautiful red vintage bag. This beautiful, you can wear it as a clutch, or you can do it as a handle. It has the tassel, snake skin, super clean on the inside. It says made in, he says made in Italy? No, made in China. But right here is vintage, and this bag is $15. It does have a zipper. $15 for the red vintage bag that you can use as a clutch. $15. Liquidation, guys. Bag number seven. Bag number seven is this patent leather Nostrums all leather bag from Nostrums. It has the outer pocket right here. It has a zipper. It's clean on the inside. It says Nostrums all leather, genuine leather Nostrums. I don't know if you see that. Patent leather with a zipper, twenty dollars. He has feet, and it's a two handle. It's another leather bag, number eight, and this is the brand. I keep forgetting this brand. Bulga. I've had this before, you guys. It's this beautiful leather, more like a cowhide. Let me put some tissue in there so we can see how it looks. Somebody was going to buy this bag. I think it was Style Maven, but then the shipping was too much to Canada. 
This is what the handle looks like. It's like a buffalo leather bag, nice. Hobo with a zipper. $20 for this bag, guys. $20, the leather is amazing. $20. See that? Got the round bottom. $20 and the inside is fabric. It says burger everywhere. $20 for that. Number? Nine. Number nine. We have this beautiful metallic. I even forgot how much I paid for this bag, but it got to go. And just have so many bags it doesn't make sense and this is by who again Amani jeans like Giorgio Armani Amani jeans this is metallic tote just need a little polishing metallic tote with a zipper gold metallic it says um, AG which is Amani jeans on the zipper pull nice little totes we got out here you can put your phone yeah so this Amani tote is $20 the inside is clean so let me show you the inside It's nice inside and it's clean. And right there, it says Amani jeans. $20, guys, for that. The fuller, fuller is in the $30 range. We got this um, alligator. Number 10 is this croc clutch that's folded over. Super cute. It has the zipper on the outside. And then you can open it. It's supposed to have a shoulder uh, strap, but there is none. So if you want to wear it as a bag, the inside is clean. It doesn't have a brand, but it is so well made. And this is $15 for this clutch. I'm trying to see who makes it. Can't find it. Oh, and then it has another zipper on the outside. Right here. So it's $15 for this clutch. There we go. That was what? Bag number what? Ten. Okay, I have the heat on and I'm hot. Okay. Bag number? Eleven. It's a vintage, all leather bag. You guys you know vintage bags are everything. I'm trying to see the coming through. Number 10 is which one? The clock folded. For who? Cheryl Jennings. Oh, Cheryl Jennings. Hi, Cheryl. Welcome. Didn't see you there. Yay. All right. Thank you. Number what? Uh, number 11. Number 11. Beautiful vintage leather. Cross body with chain. Look at the chain. Gorgeous bag. Nice vintage bag. The inside is clean. It has a zipper. The 
inside looks like this nice and soft very well made fifteen dollars for the vintage fifteen Keeping an eye for me. Mm -hmm. Number twelve. Number twelve. Another um, department store bag. This is Neiman Marcus. Crock tote. Big crock tote for Neiman Marcus. I think it's embossed crock. Just a beautiful tote to go shopping with. It's just. Just says Nimi Mac is right there. there. Number 11, yeah, the, the vintage. vintage bag. Okay. So, this Nimi Mac is tote is $20. Massimilo for this one. Thank you, Mercy. Hey, vintage is gone. 20 uh, Did I say $20? No, you said 50 No, oh, for oh, this. Oh, yeah, $20. Twenty for the Neiman's only because it's such a big, nice, heavy duty tote. If you're going to work and you have the extra stuff to carry, your shoes, your water, your lunch, be a nice, beautiful bag to carry. Neiman Marcus. It's beautiful vintage clutch. Number 13. It's patent leather on the side. And then it has, I'm trying to see who makes this. Oh, still has a price tag. It's an accordion to, um, little clutch. One, two, three section. It's vintage, doesn't have any name on the inside. It was supposed to have a little chain right here, but there isn't any. It's patent leather on the inside and this is how it goes. And this is $15 for this beautiful clutch. And this pad is um, velour, while the back pad is patent leather with some initials. $15. Okay. Okay, number what? 14. Hmm? 14. Number 14. This beautiful suede bag with a crossbody strap with two, it has two snaps to open this. It's, it's by Urban Outfitters. I don't know if you see that, double, but it is super cute. Very soft. And this is $15. $15 for the Urban Outfitter. Gorgeous little bag. Very rich. Sassy says hi. Hi, Sassy. Welcome. People, this in a twenty dollar bracket. All right, we're coming, people. I don't know. <laughs> this is a crossbody number fifteen. Number fifteen, little bag with frills. This is by H and M. Nice crossbody with the frills. $15 for H&M. Kind of an old, old vintage H&M looking bag. I'm not saying it's vintage, but it's an old, old one. That was $15. Bag number 16. 16. We're about to finish with this bin, and then we can do a little bit of clothing, and then we'll do the other bin. This is a Lancome baguette. 
cute little baguette looks it's fabric it says lancome right here it's not a cosmetic case people it is a bag it's a cute little baguette right here this right here i'll let it go for ten dollars for the lancome bag ten dollars number 17 number 17 guys i'm going deep because what's that mm -hmm. uh, this is atn agne or atn agne if you're french that is agne if you're english beautiful monogram bag leather trim with a little bit of nylon with a monogram everywhere nice shoulder and this part what's that uh all things liz hi everyone a little late was cooking chicken fajitas for the family hi at is that all still yeah is things it liz. is that it here no, all things liz. all things leads i'm not they confuse me welcome i want some of that chicken fajitas that you're cooking all right so this has three compartments. ATN Agna. Uh, ATN Agnia. It is, let me show you. Oh, Jean said, hey, ATL. You changed your name back. I so know. I it, is. it is ATL. Yeah. See? It shows the little crate right there. It says ATN Agna. Nice little leather trimmed handle leather on the bottom twenty dollars for atn number 19 number 18 sorry number 18 liz claiborne all leather bag this bag is so soft i did not when i saw it i'm like how could this be a liz claiborne bag because it is, it is super soft and cute. Let me put some tissue in here. Nice, beautiful, all leather bag. It says all leather right there. Look at the leather. Nice hobo handle. Twenty dollars for this clear one, all leather bag. I'm tired with the papers. The papers are getting under my skin. It says LC, which means Liz Claiborne. Beautiful. Two media pocket and a zipper. $20. We got this. Number 19. I cannot tell who this is. Tammy, Tammy Lynn, kind of like a Balenciaga motorcycle bag, but it's a cute little dupe of a Balenciaga metallic leather. Got a little short shoulder handle. It's, it's not a crossbody, you know. It just have the little face right here. And then we have the strings rock and roll metallic you guys know metallic is in super cute fifteen dollars for this fifteen dollars okay number 20. number 20. kathy van zillen who is in the era where kathy van zillen was everybody wanted one like oh my god i want a kathy van zillen bag here we go Kathy, but this is Kathy Van Zillen. Nice little cinch fabric tote. Look at this. Super cute. Still have the little Kathy handbag charm. Very heavy duty. It's fabric and I think leather trim. The cut on the bottom, you have the logo right there. Super cute bag. Still got the studded handle. 
$20 for Cathy Van Zillen. Still has all the studs. The inside is super clean. It's different, yeah. Familiar with Cathy Van Zillen? You know what I'm talking about. And all the stones are still on the buckle. $20 for that. Number? 21. Wilson's leather. The leather expert. Cute little crossbody Wilson leather bag. So cute. And then we have the outer pocket back here where you can just throw your keys. It has a little mirror. You don't need a mirror to put your lipstick on there. And then on the inside, it says Wilson's leather. Very nice little leather bag. $15 for Wilson's leather. Crossbody. The formal bags. Uh, said, I will take Kathy. Van Zillen? Yeah. Okay. Kathy Van Zillen for Deanna Smith. Yay! <laughs> Thank you, Deanna. Okay, number. Number 22. Number 22. This beautiful all leather VS bigger. Totes. This was supposed to be in the $30 section, but it found its way in here, so don't know how. It was supposed to be in the $25, $30 section, but it's okay. It's beautiful, two handle, outside pocket, this pocket right there, that pocket right there. We got the tassel. On the main zipper, we have another tassel on the outside zipper. It hurts me to sell this back for $20, but it was in this bin. And then we got this little buckle. $20 for VS Speaker. Yes. I don't know why it was on here. Shush. Anywho. It is what it is. Twenty dollars. I must have mistakenly put it on there. All right. Okay. Moscardini. Moscardini. Some Italian little brand. Number twenty-three. Number twenty-three bag. Crossbody. All leather. I can't even pronounce the name. I'm not Italian. It has three little compartments right here, there, there, and there. It's Firenze. It's the house of Firenze. This is $15 only because, and you can have this little part right here just reinforced. Probably because you $5 to reinforce it. This is $15, little Italian purse. Made in Italy, genuine leather. See right there? Super cool. Nice little soft crossbody. $15. Crown with the tiara. Says hi, hi, Crown with the tiara. Welcome. Okay, we got this um, crochet little tote. Number 24. Number 24. Just a two-handle tote, nice. You can just, doesn't have, it doesn't have any pockets. It's just a throw tote, but it's, looked like it was handmade, but it got feet, very nice. Almost look like a Dior. Look at the handle. $15 for this tote, $15, heavy duty. It has some weight to it. Alrighty. All right, okay, this little, last but not the least for this, for this bean. Number 25. Number 25 is a Sharif made in, made in USA. Oh God, no. Oh, oh yeah. 
Nice little Made in USA clutch. My Sharif. You want the tote? Who's that? Crown with the tiara? Yeah. Let me make sure. This tote, right? How much did I say? Fifteen dollars. All right. Crown with the tiara. Thank you. Number twenty-four. Yay. Okay. Okay. Cool. Got you. Thank you. So I was showing you this little leather Sharif vintage tote that has. I don't know if this is supposed to be like this or somebody just opened it up. I don't know. Because the other side is not. But the inside is nice and clean. Right there, vintage. <laughs> vintage, vintage. And this is $15. Snake skin and leather, vintage. And a little string if you want to do crossbody or you can just put it in there it's like a snap voila fifteen dollars and then uh, for this bean here is the last one number 26. number 26 is a beautiful clutch i mean actually a wristlet that you can wear it as a clutch it's a turn lock you open as such silver hardware and this is by Calvin Klein. What is the price for shipping, Cheryl James? It depends what you got, Cheryl. I'm still doing priority. If you buy, did she only get one bag? If you only got that one bag, I forgot how, the, what bag did she get? The crock folded. Oh, the crock folded. It's probably $11 for that shipping, Cheryl. If that's the only thing you're going to get. Uh, Sharon Williams was asking, viewing from New York, can I see number 22 again? Need it for my birthday. Number 22, which one is the that? The Via Spiga, light brown. Oh, the Via Spiga. Girl, if you don't get that back for $20, I'm going to put it back <laughs> with the rest of it. That next time, that bag is 45 I don't know why it's in here, but I'll show you. Okay, first, let's finish this. This is $15, Calvin Klein, beautiful wristlet. Let me, I'll show you that, uh, Cheryl Williams. And then we have a zipper and we have a side pocket. All right, so $15 for that Calvin Klein. All right, here's the VS Spiegel. Beautiful bag. I don't know why it's in here. I am so regretting, but I, I have to do what I have to do because that's just how retail is. You guys remember me saying you... You pay what you see. So I'm trying to be true to my word. So this is what it looks like. It's handheld. It's all leather VS bigger. It has this claps right here where you can go into the pocket. And then we have two side pockets on the side. It's a little wrinkle because you got to fill it in. And then we have another zipper up here with a tassel. And then on the inside, it's very clean. Even though it's still pre-love, it says VS Spiegel right here. I don't know if you see that. And we have a zipper and two media pockets. Beautiful tool handle. So, there it is. Voila. She says need it. <laughs> you need it, does it mean you want it? Is it sold? Say sold, number two. I, I know some people say I need it, but I have to make sure that she's yeah. really buying it. 20, that's number 20. Did you, is that, a, is that a sale? Who's that? Sharon Williams. Sharon Williams, is that a sale? Let me know so I can give you a bell. I need for you to say sale. Or sold. Okay. Sold. Sold? Yay. Thank you, Cheryl Williams. Don't forget your address when you send me your money, honey. All right, so being number one, we still didn't liquidate a lot of stuff. It's like, oh my God, should I donate all these bags? Because I am losing my mind. If there was a bag in here that you want and you want to 
pay less for it, holler at me. If I can let it go for less, I will, because I'm looking like I'm about to put all this in a bag and send it to Hope of the Valley. Because I'm not, I'm tired of sitting with these bags here. They got to get up out of here. So if you see something here you want, let me know. All right. So I have another bean that's $25 to $30, but... Tracy Prey says hello. Hi, Tracy. Welcome, welcome. But that bean, before I do the bean, let me, let me do a couple of dresses so that we're not... Let, I got another bean for 25 and 30 and up. Shopping around. Shipping around 11. Oh, shipping around 11 for what, baby? All right, so. I hate doing this clothing. I really do, but I will. Remy's looking at me like, what? Where my hang is at? What did I do with the hang? All right, I'm coming, guys. All right, let's liquidate a couple of clothes. Oh, Sharon asked about shipping. Sharon? Yeah. That's oh, oh, that's what. Janine, yeah. Oh, that's what. Eleven dollars for that particular bag. Thank you, Janine, for that. Eleven dollars for shipping, Cheryl Williams. So your bag be thirty some dollars. Not even the price for what I was trying to sell it for. All right. When we get to clothing, Remy, we're doing letters. Okay. We're gonna go back to bags when we do the other bean. Okay. Right? Are we doing letters now? No. Yeah, letters. Okay. Sorry, my bad. Mix nouveau full skirt. By Mix Nouveau. Letter A. Size large. Letter A. Five dollars. Very flowy. Five dollars. Mix Nouveau. We're doing some clothing now, guys. We're gonna mix this. We're gonna mix it up. Letter B. Letter B. Black. Blackbird, nice little high and low, chartreuse, top, size large, $5. Letter C. Letter C. USA extra small, which I don't know why is here. I should be donating this. But it looks big. It's a shirt, Forever 21. $5. Still brand new with a tag. Letter D. Letter D. Full legged pants by Chic, Chic C. Nice full legged. With with elasticized waist, size large, five dollars. Letter E. Letter E. This from Ailey showroom. Nice little. Oh, backwards. Another. Why do I have so many larges? Ask me why. This cute little top, lace top. And the back has this part right there. The sleeves are lace, $5. Letter, Letter what? Yeah. Ricardo, I got men's shirt if you if you're still around, I have some shirts for men. I have this is men's. I have bought this for hubby. 
But he, he does not like prints. He looked at me like I was crazy, like, who's going with that? I'm like, you? He was like, oh, no. He likes his sweatpants and all that stuff. So this is brocade. Even we make them wear this. You can just put a belt brand new with tags. $5. It's like a 4X. It's really not that big. Still brand new. $5. He didn't want it. You can get this for your man. Here's the other color. Still new. Never wore it. $5 men's shirt. That you can wear it as... A, if you want to wear it as a female piece, you can put a belt on there. It's brand new. $5. You guys remember I sold a couple of these before for full price. Uh, crown with the tiara wants letter C. Which one is that? Which is the Forever 21 shirt. Oh, the small. shirt? Yeah. The $5 shirt? Crown yeah. with the tiara? Mm hmm Okay. Thank you, crown with the tiara. Yeah. Put that with your bag. Okay, we have this pre preemie nice little vest. It has the elongated front that you can tie. Or you can do it as a wrap around. It's beautiful size. How many am I buying this from? She size said, medium. I she wants the men black shirt too. Oh okay. Yeah, Versace. The Versace. Oh yeah, I should have said Versace print. You think? Thank you for that. All right, yay! That would look good. I don't know why my hobby. He's just so picky. It's, that's a nice shirt. So we got this little wrap around cardigan, $5, size medium. Hey, <laughs> LOL, for real. He should have gotten that. I was pissed. We were going out one day. I said, you want to wear your Versace looking shirt? He looked at me like, oh no. I'm like, what? Wasted my money. All right. Anywho, five dollars for that cardigan. Cry and us. Nice little letter I. Letter I jumpsuit with the piping on the side. I sold this in my boutique, guys. This is way back when. Size medium, very stretchy. And then it has the zipper. It's off the shoulder like this. I don't know why I'm letting this go, but I don't think I'll reach for it. So, $5. Beautiful turtleneck sweater with a star in the front. Super long, super soft. Got a slit on the side. If you're in the East Coast, this is your friend. Nice little turtleneck. Look at it. Letter Look at J. Letter J, $5. Yeah. Okay. Letter K. Letter K. No, this is not $5. That's Vince Camuto. I think not. That's in the $10 pack. Okay. We got a black duster by... Luna, black duster. With big lapels. It's missing a belt. But it's good to just wear and throw throw over something. Size large, $5. Very crepey fabric. And long, $5. Okay. Size large, bodycon dress by Shein. Size L. large, letter L, five dollars. Okay. 
letter letter M. Letter M. This full legged pants. It has a elasticized waist and a drawstring. It has this piping everywhere. It's a size size large. Five dollars. Very heavy duty. Yes. Who who got the body contracts? Um, Ginny. Ginny got it. I thought she just gave a bell. She wants it. Oh, she wants yeah. the body con. Mm -hmm. Okay. Where is it? Okay. Thank you, Ginny. Yay. Five dollars. Five dollars. Cause you guys, after all this is being donated. That's for sure, because they're coming to pick them up on Thursday. Hope of the Valley coming. So these pants are $5, very heavy, size large. Full legs, easy, breezy, drawstring. Another beautiful bodycon dress. Black, checkered, extra large. Letter, letter N. Letter who? N. Letter N, as in Nancy. Bodycon, extra extra large, very stretchy. $5. And then this is the green of the duster. I showed you guys the black. This is the green one. This one has a belt. Letter O. Letter O. With a lapel. Got a O with a lapel. I love this. I'm like five dollars. I can see in the springtime coming to play. What? Hold on, people. You know, sometimes you have a buyer's remorse or seller's remorse. <laughs> You'll be like, why that sell that? Okay, here we are. It should be with a ten dollar section, but the black was five, the green is five, so they're both gonna be five dollars. But if this does not sell, I'm not donating it. I would just keep it. So let me put that over there. Five dollars for whoever wants it. Okay. So that's it for the five dollar dresses. We are going to move on to. Actually, I got one more dress. Oh, this little t-shirt dress, size large, letter P, letter P by Chinese, it's wrapped. Uh, Keisha Summer says, I want it. Which one, Keisha? I think the green duster. The duster? <laughs> okay. Shooks. All right. So, don't forget your eye dress. Yay for Keisha. Bye bye, Duster. Five dollars. All right. <laughs> All right. So there is this beautiful wrapped in the front dress. This dress is so sexy. On I can oh I can't even begin to tell you guys. Super cute size. What is size? Size large, like a t-shirt dress and wrapped in the front, $5. All right, that's it for the $5 items for today. We go, cause you guys ain't got no energy. So they can pick all this up. I don't have time to. Hope the valley can take it away. I saw one item before I put the rest away. It's this dress, size small, Letter white. Q. Hmm? Letter Q. Letter Q. Nice little summer flowery dress. It's a size small, but it runs big. I remember me wearing this dress, so I keep it. Maybe somebody wants it. It's five dollars. All right, so that's it for the $5 liquidation dresses. We have $10 ones, but 
We're going to do bags now. The other bags. And then after that other bag, we're going to go back to... Anybody want to see some vintage pieces? Let me know. But uh, let's start with this. With the $25 to $30 bags. Another bean. $25. We're going back to numbers, Remy. Mm -hmm. What number did we end up with? Number 27. Number 27. All right. Twenty-five to thirty dollars. Here we come. All leather, number twenty-seven. Mm -hmm. All leather, Michael Kors totes with two side pockets. Super soft, no scratches. It has feet. The leather is super soft. Thirty dollars for mm -hmm. Michael Kors. The inside is pre-loved, but it's clean. $30. Hold on, guys. Let me bring this. Let me bring this here somewhere where I can get to it. So that was $30. Number 20. 28. 28. 28 is coach. Monogram coach. Kind of vintage looking with a zipper. It's almost look like the Alma bag. Hold on guys, the, this came apart. Let me put it back with a crossbody. It's beautiful coach bag. Come on. $30 for this coach. It's a tool handle in very good condition. It has your coach label right there. And the back, it's just been stored in my bin for a minute. So if you put stuff in there, it's going to come correct. And then we got the back pocket. $30 for this coach. Monogram canvas and leather trim. And then we do have the dog tag. Twenty, I mean thirty dollars. Okay. Number. Number twenty-nine. Number twenty-nine. I have this rock and roll. Free people bag, distressed leather that is buffalo leather, very soft. It has that handle there. It has this handle, which I don't know what for. I have no clue, but that's just the style. I guess if you can carry it as such. And um, it has a zipper. It's free people. The inside looks like this. The leather is very, very tough. Free people, $30 for free people. Nice leather tote, buffalo leather. Number 30. Number 30. Patent leather coach with the monogram. Very shiny. Nothing wrong with this beautiful bag. But I'm bringing it to you guys for next to nothing because I'm tired of seeing bags in my face in this garage. The inside is super clean. This is kind of new. Why is it here? I just bought this bag, I think, from Uptown Chipskate. Hold on. All right. Well, this is going to be $35. Let me at least get my money back. $35 for this coach. $35. 
It was still with me. Oh, um. Uh huh. Janine, what? Janine's mom wants the coach. Which one? The black one? The. Yeah. This one I just showed? Number? Yeah. What, what number is this? This is number 30. Number 30? Janine, Miss Emma, this one? Oh, the, the brown one. Oh, the, the brown, brown one, the yeah. monogram. Okay. $30. This one for Miss Emma. Yay. Thank you, Miss Emma. Thank you, Jenny. this i don't know how i'm giving you guys a valentino but it's a valentino or landy bag remy wants a raise <laughs> he's living here rent free that's good enough <laughs> he ain't paying rent that's his raise valentino or landy made in italy I just this one is $35 guys. It has feet, $35. <laughs> yeah, see. <laughs> Mom does have a point. What was this one? Here? Um Valentino Orlandi number 31. Number 31, you can do a shoulder. If you shorter, you can do it as a double crossbody or you can make it it has that bow right there it says Valentino. You could thirty five dollars for that. Oh, why am I putting that over there? That's not a slow one. Okay. Number thirty-two. Number thirty-two. Who's this? Italian. Robert. Roberta Gandolfini. Uh huh. I will remember this Italian vintage. Roberta Gandolfini bag. Bonded leather. Nice. Made in Italy. It's so structured. Made in Italy. How much did I pay? And the inside says it right there. China. It's so stiff, guys. It says Roberta Gandolfini everywhere. This beautiful Italian bag is $30. $30. Super, super, super cute. Oh, I just love the shine to it. It almost looks like a patent leather, but it's not. $30. Number 33. Number 33. Francisco Bazia since 19 since 1977. Beautiful white Francisco Bazia bag. Hobo. With a zipper. And a beautiful buckle on both sides. Summer is coming. We have this outer zipper right. I mean pocket out here. And then on the back is just plain. $30 for Francisco Bazia. The inside is clean. Right there. $30. Number. Number 34. Number 34. Metallic coach tote. With two handle. Metallic coach. It has the CCs everywhere. Nice metallic leather. Metallic is in, guys. Super cute. And inside is clean. 
looked like it was never used because he has a thread hanging has the creed right there no it was used i see a little dirt oh yeah it has a little pre-love i tried to get this off like somebody's lipstick was just whatever but anyway thirty dollars nobody's looking inside your bag thirty dollars for this beautiful coach a vintage heavy duty michael Kors. that will hide here forever number 35 number 35 is this gotta go number 35 michael Kors. vintage vintage bag tough leather see this look at the handle michael Kors. The leather is everything, guys. Oh. It says Michael Kors on the buckles. It's a little vintage discoloration right there. But this Michael Kors bag, let me hear somebody saying something. No, they're just saying nice. Yeah. $30 for the Michael Kors. $30. Vintage. Number number thirty six. Number thirty six. Beautiful. B. Mikowski. Soft leather hobo bag. Oh, my nose is running. B. Mikowski. Super soft. N nice caramel buttery color. It has a snap. The inside has the signature leopard skin animal print. B. Mikowski, $30. Number 37. Number 37. Another bulga bag. The other one was twenty dollars. This one is going to be thirty. It's a beautiful leather two handle bag by Bulger. Nice soft leather with studs. You see this leather, guys. And then he has this little thing right here that looked like a little trumpet, whatever, coming through. It has a tassel. It has a tassel. And this leather bulga bag is $30. $30. Guys, I'm losing my pants. Like, huh? $30. Oh, Monica says afternoon, everyone. Aw. Super, super late, Monica. How you doing? Hope you're doing fine. $30 for the bulga. It has a tassel. The handle is nice. Let me show you the inside. It has a zipper. Oh, God. It's cold in here. My nose is running. Janine said I have that in dark brown I got from you. Oh, this, oh really? Guys, I be having double stuff without even knowing. Yes, look at the leather, guys. Look. Do you see how, that's how soft this bag is. Nice. And the inside has the flowers. A smiley face flowery. Right. The spring is coming. Number 38. Number 38. Mm -hmm. Kohan. Beautiful cool handbag. It's just open. There's no zipper on here. This cool hand fabric and leather hobo bag. 
nice trimmed almost look like a gucci but it's kohan it's a beautiful bag will be good for easter oh it does have a zipper why was i saying it did and we have that coat the zipper pull right here it's kind of heavy thirty dollars for the kohan Okay, this cute Zara Join Life little hobo bag, almost like a number 39, number 39 almost like a boot. This is not a pre love bag, so it does not belong here. I'm so sorry, people. No, that's enough. Okay. That goes with a new one. It's not liquidation. Except somebody want to buy it, but it's, it's $35 if anybody wanted to buy it, but it's not. Don't put that on there, right? I didn't. Okay. We have another number 39. 39. Beautiful. Cheesy. Yeah. Another Cole Beautiful Cole handbag with pockets. Double sided. Right there. It's more like, a, I don't know what color I will call this bag. But this is how cute it is. I want to see how it looks with tissue on it. It's more like a boat bag. But it's a Kohan. And this, it says Kohan right here. Nice leather. Number forty. Number forty. This coach bag I had put in a washer. I washed this bag, so <laughs> it has it's it's fabric. Coach everywhere, but it has bubbles. Somebody told me to iron it, but guys, I ain't got the time or energy. But it has little bubbles. But it's a coach bag. It's a leather trim. So because of this, is this is gonna be twenty dollars. It should have been with the other bags, but I guess I was going for the name or the coach creed. Twenty dollars just to shop around. Nothing to it. Number forty one. Number 41, cute little Kate Spade. Mm -hmm. Nice little nylon Kate Spade. Gorgeous little number. The inside is pink. It says Kate Spade right here. You can burn some of these little threads, just burn it out. And this case spade is $25. It's just nylon, $25. Oh, how is it? oh, girl, that's a different story for another day. It's still, it, his eyes are good, but they gave him an antibiotics that he became allergic to. And he just, it's, it break him out. We got to go see a dermatologist. It break him out so badly. So, yeah. It's been a it's been a thing. The eyes are okay because he had debris in his eye, so they took it out. But uh, the antibiotics they gave him before, they did not know he was allergic to penicillin. So he woke up with hives all over his face and neck. So that's what we're working on. And he's going through it. All right, so. And then there's this number. 42. Brand new. Bokia bag, nylon, still has all the trimmings. Bokia makes great bags, if you're familiar with Bokia. Nice little shopping tote right there. It still has the plastic. She said sorry. Yeah, thank you. It has the side zipper and two media pockets. Jean said he's in her prayers. Hmm? Jean said he's in her prayers. 
Well, thank you guys. Yeah. It's like your girl can't go through my nails. I'm just saying. And then he has the zipper right here. And another zipper right here. This book here bag, brand new, is 25 oh, and 139 and 40. Which one is 39 that? 39 is the Kohan orange bag. Mm -hmm. And the other one is the coach bag for $20. Uh, what number? 40. No, but what, you said the other one is what? I know I got oh, this 39 one. 39 is the cool, that one. Uh huh. And then 40 is the coach bag for $20. Oh, the, the coach bag for $20. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Let me pull it. I had it. What did I do with it? Oh, there it is. I put it in the twenty dollar bin. So this is Vicky. Yeah. Margaret. Yeah. Thank you, Vicky. Yeah. Macy Miller says Remy get mom her water bottle. Oh yeah. Thank you, Marcy. Yeah. My mouth is dry. See, I technically did. <laughs> Thank you. I needed that. I don't know why I wasn't thinking. It's a mid full. Number what? 43. Number 43. It's beautiful. Handheld. Patent leather. Gorgeous bag with this buckle. When I saw this bag, I thought it was Chloe or something. But I forgot who makes it. Oh, it's Hobo International. Let me put some stuff in here. I think I put way too much stuff. But anyway, I put too much paperwork. This is Hobo International. You you just kind of pull it in like this. Super cute. Nice one handle. $30 for Hobo International. It's patent leather and this is not suede. It's like wool. Patent leather and wool mixed like fabric. $30 for Hobo International. The inside is clean. Oh, Monica said, gave you my like. Hmm? Monica said, gave you my like. What does that mean? Like, thumbs up. Oh, thumbs up? Okay. Thank you, Monica. So, Hobo International. $30 for Hobo International. Another Kohan. Number 44. Number 44, Sierra Open Weave Bag. This bag is cute. It shouldn't be here. But super cute with a zipper. This is going to be 35, an exception, because it's very well made. $35 for this bag. Kohan Open Weave Leather. And fabric. Okay. A big number forty five. Number what? Forty five. Number forty five. Cake laundry. Kind of patchwork to totes. I mean to handle with a snap. This is $25 for Kate Laundry. $25. Has this snap right here. Kate Laundry, $25. Nice shopping tote with feet. Somebody say something? Right now? No. Oh. Very different, Jeannie. Let me just tell you that somebody did uh -huh. say something. Okay. Number? Number 46. Number 
It's another coach bag. Vintage coach. Hold on, guys. Let me put it together. Beautiful metallic vintage coach that has like little coach written all over it. It's cute, but you know, with the metallic, you're always going to find a little bit of discoloration. So there is a discoloration right there, which is on the back side of the coach. We have the kiss lock in the middle. Voila, the inside is light blue. And then on this side, we have the two media pockets. And then on this side, we have a zipper pocket and the Coach Creed right there. And this is $30, metallic. It's some kind of, I mean, it's metal, it's like bronzy metallic. 19 established 1941 Little cute vintage pour de soie, Donny Karen totes, tiny little tote. It says DK, it's not DK and Y, it's plain old Donny Karen, which is the expensive line. DK and Y is the sports and cheaper line. See right there, it says Donny Karen. That was way back when. This. This had a, a, a price on here that was a little pricey. But anyway, this is $25 for Donna Karen tote. $25 black tote if you have somewhere nice to go. I don't know what this is. Let's just see it right there. I think this is just a little, I could wipe it with water. $25 for Donna Karen tote. Yeah. Number 48 is a Ted Baker blue crossbody patent leather by Ted Baker. You guys, if you go to Nostrum's Rack, Ted Baker bags are selling for like $300, $298. I know this is pre loved, but it's super cute. And look at the buckle. Just needs to burn a little bit of frill stick, a lighter. It says Ted Baker right here. And you know, Ted Baker love animals. So the inside has a lot of little doggies right there. They're like little pugs or something. How cute is that? And then we have the outer pocket right here. Being that we've had this bag for so long, I have to let it go for $25. It's been here for a minute. 25 Ted Baker, beautiful blue bag, semi-luxury. Anybody gonna tell you you're not wearing a luxury bag? Like, go sit down. I'm wearing a Ted Baker, okay? All right, why is this all tangled? What, 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 what is this? The heaven's name. I ain't got time to untangle. Number 49. Number what? 49. Number 49 is a beautiful Brighton bag with a bow in black. Brighton. Been here for a minute. Beautiful bow right there. Nice Brighton leather. 
we have the little heart right there. I'm brighten. And then we have the zipper pull. Super cute. Brightening bag is $25. $25 for brightening. Uh, brightening. <laughs> brightening. Only because it has a little bit of scratches right here on the metal. $25 for a brightening bag. All leather. The inside is clean. $25 for that. Number what? Number 50. Number 50. All right. This little bola is by Etienne Agna. Almost look like a Bottega. It's a Etienne Agna, Etienne Agne, uh, vintage bola. It's woven with the A for Agna or Agna right there or Agne. It has feet. It's all leather, nice little tote. $25 for the ATN bag. Let me show you the inside. It's giving you the Bottega vibe with the woven. The woven is very tight, like super tight. It has just one zipper pocket. It's leather on this side, leather on the bottom. The zipper tab is lead and metal, $25. Number 51. Number 51. LJ Simon, New York. This is vintage. LJ Simon, New York. It's croc and pony skin, vintage. This is a super bag. What's that? Uh, Jay Supplies is Jackie Red. Red is my color, yeah. I know. And a lady told me that at Goodwill when I was trying on a red jacket. She said, that's definitely your color. And I'm like, okay. I should, you know, put some more red in my closet. I don't have that many red. But I see why. Thank you for that, Tracy. So I want to show you guys this bag. Ah, this is pony, animal print, but it's pony hair. That's what I was thinking those shoes brands were the other day when you couldn't peel off the sticker. Mm. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. 51 for Sassy Nola. Luck, Which yeah. one is that? The one you're showing. Oh, this one for Sassy? Sassy, you got a good one. It's, look at the hardware, super heavy. $30, Sassy Nola. It's, I think this is like a genuine croc. Oof. Yes. $30 for Sassy Nola, yay. Cute. Yeah, I love this bag. I'm, I'm jealous, Sassy, even though you got it. I'm like, hmm, why was I sleeping on this bag? Yokes. Yes, thank you, Sassy. Wait, well. Okay. What the hell is this thing? Ah, hmm. I was supposed to take this thing back to Goodwill. This a uh, wanna be GG bag. I was because it's missing a tassel, and it is. You know, it is what it is. Twenty dollars, if Number anybody 52. wants that. Number fifty-two, twenty dollars. I paid fifteen, twenty bucks. That is, if anybody wants it. I don't know what I did with the receipt. I was going to take it back, but I wasn't even looking. All right. 
Oh, what's, the, what's this her name again? Um, I'll be losing my mind sometimes. Junior Drake. Oh. <sighs> I can't see for nothing. A Junior Drake bag. Our girl, Junior Drake. Beautiful hobo. Leather trim and canvas, Junior Drake. If you're familiar with, you're not familiar, she's a sister. Made beautiful bags. There she is on the inside with a picture just chilling. See her right there? Junior Drake is $30. Beautiful, nice. Hobo bag. I know a lot of people, when I first saw Junior Drake last, was it last year or two years ago, everybody was asking me for a Junior Drake bag. Yeah, I have one. I'm liquidating. Ha ha. Make it make sense. All right. So there's that. That was thirty dollars for Junior Drake. Okay. Woo! What is this? Number so, fifty-four. Number who? Fifty-four. Number fifty-four. Gusto. Another heavy-duty leather bag. By Gusto, kind of. The leather is super heavy, guys. If you live overseas, you don't want to buy this bag because shipping is going to cost you an arm and a leg. Because overseas, I cannot do priority. This bag is super cute. Look at the leather. Look at the silhouette. This bag is going to be $35. I will not do it any justice for $30. $35 for that. It wasn't supposed to be here. It's supposed to be with the rest of the other bags. But here it is. Beautiful leather. Deep chocolate brown. There we are. Here's the zipper. Here's the zipper pull on the inside. It's super deep down there. And it has two side pockets and a zipper pocket. All right. Got a few more to go. Because there will be next time. Vintage white crossbody bag. Number All leather. 55. Number 55. Vintage leather bag by Marlene. By Marlene Gaines, uh, fine leather. It's more like a vertical. The leather is so soft, guys. This is like a vintage. Look at the piping. $25 for this vintage white bag or leather. $25. Number 56. Number 56. What time is it? Because I see you tapping. Okay, this is Mauricio Tawuti. Genuine leather. Made in Italy. Made in Italy. Mauricio Tawuti. Let me put something on there. Let's see how Mauricio looks. I'm going to create a website, guys. Yeah, I could just tell Remy to help create me a website because some of these bags, I don't want to keep bringing it to you guys. I could just list it on my website and what sells, sells. It can just stay there until I liquidate them. This Mauricio bag, all leather Italian bag, $30. Very light, but it's made in Italy and the leather is just yummy soft. $30 for that bag. Number? Uh, 57. 57 looks like, looks like a Gucci bag, but it's not. It's a canvas look alike 
since I stuffed it. Yeah, so that's why I'll be trying to stuff some of these bags so they can see. I know it takes a whole lot of time to stuff a bag, but sometimes it's worth it. This cute little tote. Number 57. Number 57. Just a plain old canvas tote. There's nothing to it. It's a full leather handle and a trim. Just canvas. Nothing here. I would let this go for fifteen dollars if anybody wants it. Fifteen dollars. It was in the wrong section. It was supposed to be with a fifteen and twenty dollar pile. So it's fifteen dollars for this. Number fifty-eight. Number fifty-eight. Crossbody vintage envelope bag. You guys, if you're familiar with these bags, they sell very well on eBay. It has a crossbody vintage envelope, kind of like a sequin bag. The inside is super clean. And then it's got this part right here. Just plain old vintage, no name. But for some reason, people love this bag. So this is going to be $20. Twenty dollars. Twenty dollars. Almost there, guys. Almost there. Let me see if I have a heart attack. What's this? Oh. No, this one. This one doesn't go here. Number fifty nine. This little, um, what do we call this bag again? Round, round. What is this bag? What's the description of this? Is this a bowler? No, it's not. It's not a camera case. This cute little bag is by Vales. I think made in Venezuela. Nice bag. Oh, the Gucci jupe for, for, Emma, for, for yeah. Miss Emma? Mm -hmm. Okay, where is it at? Where did I put it? Did you not see? Did you see? Oh, there it is. How much did I say? 15. 15? Thank you, Miss Emma. Yay. Okay. This is by the brand called Vales. Almost look like um what bag is this again? Oh, I'm drawing blank. But anyway, it's like a round bag with a zipper. Maybe is it either Colombia or Argentina? Hold on if I tell you guys something else. Oh my God, my nose. She said thanks. You're welcome. Genuine leather. I can't tell where it's made. It's just way in here. So this bag is $25. Crossbody. Goya. There you go, Jeannie. Thank you. <laughs> I was drawing blank. This looks like a Goya, if you look at it from afar. But it's Vales. Yes. Oh, my God. I don't know myself sometimes. Oh, damn. Back stays there. Okay, we're almost there. It's beautiful eel skin. Number 60. Number 60, crossbody. All leather with an outside pocket, but it's eel skin. Super cute with like a bamboo trim right there. Gift line, genuine eel skin. $25 for the eel skin. 
You can wear it as a clutch and you can wear it as a crossbody. $25. Yay! We're done here. Oh. Number? Uh, 61. Number 61. A double-sided bag that looked like a isomayaki. Don't know why this is here, though. Two in one bag. You have this. And then someday if you want to show this way, you could. You can even take it off and wear one bag at a time. Why? Why is this bag here, though? It's like a isomayaki dupe. Cute. So this is $30. You have two in one, or you can wear them both. Crossbody, if you feel... Like you want to wear pink, you can do the pink side. If you feel like you want to wear that, you can wear this. Or you can take them apart and wear one at a time. Two in one for $30. Wow. All right. Last but not the least for the liquidation is a Marc Jacobs. 62. Number 62. Mark by It's not Marc by Marc Jacobs. It's just Marc Jacobs. Vintage. Way back when? Way back when bag? Oh, Keisha wants the two in one. Two in one? Yeah. Keisha? Yeah. Okay. Yay, Keisha! Woohoo! Super cute. So we were letting a Mark Jacobs go for $35. Vintage, metallic. Mark Jacobs just need a little bit of refurbishing. It's more like a metallic um, leather. $35 for Mark Jacobs. Super heavy. The inside is that. This is, I think, this is part of his cruise collection. Somebody say something, Remy. No, she's, thank you. Okay. And there's this zipper right here. On the outside where you can put your phone. And this is it. Super soft. Mark Jacobs bag for $35. Hello. Alrighty. Oh, there was there was one more. I thought that was the last, but there was one more hiding. This beautiful snake skin clutch. You can do it as a bag. Or you can do it as a clutch. 63. Number 63, it just opens like this. And this is um, Sandra Roberts. Sandra Roberts. Sandra Roberts. Sandra Roberts. Snake skin. Cute, $20. Super cute. So that's that. Oh, I keep saying the last one. Which one is that? Somebody says something with me. It's, um, Sassy Nova says, how much is 59? Is it gray leather? Which one is the 59? The Veles round bag. Oh, that Italian, I mean, the Spanish bag, this bag. It says leather, I think. How much is was it? Gray it? leather. Yeah. 25. I mean, what does this say? Because I cannot see. Read that instruction in there for me. It's gray leather, yeah. The less. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What else? What's this? Uh, say? Four. Four le leaner lovers. I'm talking about the fabric. Oh. What's it made of? Okay, we we a lot of blind people in this house, so we can see a thing. It said, oh, made in Colombia, uh -huh. Valles. I'm trying to see if it's leather. It's written in Spanish. It has a lot of literature. I don't know if it is. It didn't say, but it is some kind of gray and black leather. Yeah, strap look like leather. 
So I would say it's leather. I mean, I don't know. It's up to you. If it's leather, it's bonded. All right. Last but not the least, I keep saying this. But this is Charles Jordan, made in Spain. A little Charles Jordan. Read what somebody say, Remy. It's cute. Mm -hmm. This green vintage Charles Jordan bag. Where's my shoe? And this is $25 for Charles Jordan. I have a lot of Charles Jordan vintage shoes. You can make it shorter by tying it this way, or you could just let it drop. It depends on how you how you want to do it. All right, guys, that's it for the bags. Bags are out of here. Until next time. The twenty dollar bin ones are going to be donated, but the thirty dollar one, I don't know what I'm gonna do with them. Maybe. Well, we shall see TBD to be determined what to do with these bags. Okay. So the bags are done. So, voila. What time is it, Remy? Oh, sheesh, Remy's about to kill me. How much is the gray bag? Sassy, what's that bag, Remy? It was the Veles. The Veles? Mm -hmm. well, how much? It was 25 25, Sassy. Who's that? Sophia, rather? No, that was Monica's Spader. What'd she say? She just said Sophia, rather, or something. What is and that, then, Monica? Sharon Williams asked, what's the price for number 45? What's number 45? The Kate Laundry bag. $25. Kate Laundry? 25. Was it 25? Yeah. $25. Yeah. Who was that? Sassy Nola will take the Veles bag. Okay. Thank you, Sassy, for your Veles. And, um, yeah. What other questions there? Um, nothing else. Let me pull up. I said, um, somebody asked a question. Oh, it's Monica meant Sophia Vergara's home, Colombia. Oh, Colombia. <laughs> yeah. You watch the movie yet on Netflix? Show. Show. Hmm? It's a show. That show. Whatever. What's her name again? Anyway. Um, Griselda. Did you did you watch Grisella? I can't wait to watch it. I wanna watch Grisella. Griselda. Huh? Griselda. Griselda. Okay, Remy, I'm not Spanish. I try. He always trying to correct his mama. Griselda, mom, not Gisela, whatever. But I, I hear it was good. Anybody watch it yet? She watched it. You watched it? Did you like it? Should I be wasting my time watching? All right, guys, let me show you a couple of $10 pieces. All right, let's go back to the dresses because I know some people want this. $10 dresses, this is going to be fast. This is Doogie by Whoopi Goldberg, size extra large. It's a, I don't know what this is. It's like a duster by Whoopi. Right there, $10 extra large. If I show you, if I close this hole. This is Sanctuary Clothing. Super cute, baby doll. $10 size. Size what? I think it's one size. It's a free size. You can wear this as a dress or as a duster. $10. Who's that? Um, Deanna Smith asked, do you have any sunglasses? Thomas James. Yeah. Remember the one who asked me what color? They only have that color, Deanna. I still have that, but I think it's upstairs. If you want that, let me know. <coughs> Did you see one, the gold vintage jacket, Deanna? 
I can reduce the price for you. Because, you know, I have all these vintage pieces. I'm wearing the vintage sweater. Yeah, I did. We did answer your question. What was that, number 45? You answer my price for number 25. How much was it? You said it was 25. $25. Who was that? Cheryl, Cheryl Jennings? Williams. Cheryl, Cheryl Williams. Williams. Yeah. $25. Cheryl Williams. Sorry about that. $25 for that. What bag is that again? Um, it was... The Kate, Kate Laundry? Laundry. Yeah. Kate Laundry. $25. <clears throat> All right, we got this baby doll. NY collection. Beautiful dress. Size. Uh, mm, I hate it when I can find the sizes to these things. Sheesh. Hold on. $10, whatever it is. Hold on, I'm trying to get the size. <clears throat> Size medium, ten dollars. <clears throat> what am I breaking? Sharon Williams said, "I need it. Can I see, please?" Where is that bag? I think I put it away. Hold on, hold on. Monty, whatever. <laughs> Size medium. Little dress, baby doll, ten dollars. Let me find a bag for you. Hold on. You say Cheryl Williams? Mm -hmm. Okay. It's a kid laundry, right? Yeah. Oh my god! I think I, I had just dropped every bag. Was it with the first? Um, was it with the first ones or the second? Was it with the second showing? No, this. Yeah, the second one, yeah. Kid laundry, right? Yeah. Is this it? Oh my god. Yeah. Hold on, Tommy. This is it. Can you see it? Cheryl, it has feet. The inside is super clean. It has a zipper pocket and two media pockets. Two handles that has the flip. Sold. Sold? Yeah. Okay. And then, then Thank you. Uh-huh. I'm going to ask, what's the price for the jacket? $40, Deanna. You know it retails for $400, but I'm giving $40 for the vintage made in, made in Italy. This is... I know if I list this on any site, I would get so much for it. But I'm giving it to you for $40. Only because it's you. Because you're a good customer. $40 for you. And one more. Mm -hmm. Nick's Nina says, is number 28 still available? What's number 28? Uh, oh, that was the Coach Monogram tan bag, but Miss Emma has that one. The tan coach is gone. Just the black patent leather one is still available. The tan one is gone bye-bye. All right. What else did Deanna ask before that? I forgot she had asked for something else. Before we oh the Thomas sunglasses, James, yeah. <coughs> I do have Thomas James. You saw it before, Deanna. So I have this W Worthington size twelve dress. She said, "What is the reduced price for it?" That it was fifty. I gave it to you for forty. That's that's the reduced price. Remember, I had told you fifty before, <coughs> but I'll give it to you for forty. It's worth four hundred dollars. It's three ninety eight, but I'm um, four is super cute. Forty dollars is my lowest I can go. Uh, 
Sharon says, do I have to pay for two shipping or just $11 for both? Oh, no. Now, shipping has come up to $17 because I'll put them both in a priority box because it's not going to fit in a small leather, you know, for one bag. But now that you have two bags, shipping is $17. It's not separate. It's just a bigger box that would take two bags. So $17 for shipping. Can say? I uh, see the Brighton bag number 49? Why did I put those bags away? It's like, oh, why did you do that? Why? Uh, Brighton number 49. Let's go back, take everything. Coming. Coming, Vicky. Give me a minute. Oh, no, we need to. Okay. You want to see the Brighton? Here it is with the bow right here. Nice leather, very soft. The handle is still intact. We got the gold charm, the heart charm. Then we have the little hearts on the pull on. The inside is nice and clean. Nice hobo. Bright. How much was this, Remy? This was uh, 25. You sure? Yeah. Okay. $25. <laughs> I miss myself sometimes. $25, Vicky, for the Brighton bag. <clears throat> nice little leather. Look at that. You take it? Okay. Yay. Run back down. Deanna Smith, I will let you know. How much is the shipping for my purse? What purse did she get? The Kathy? You only you only got one bag, right? The Kathy Van Zillen? Is that what you got? <coughs> yeah. All right. $11 for one for shipping for one bag. One bag, one bag. So she's tricky. One bag. And um, I have a lot of vintage sweaters, guys. If anybody is interested, uh, I see nobody's looking at a ten dollar stuff. So forget it. We're not doing that. <laughs> Somebody else asked me for this jacket. Is it crown with a tiara? Somebody had asked me for this jacket. This heavy duty. Vintage jacket made in Italy. I think I get a price. It was fifty, but today is forty dollars. But if I list them on Poshmark, they will be eighty nine. So, if you hear you ask me for this, it's gonna be forty dollars today. Made in Italy. Beautiful. Wait, how much? Sorry. Mm -hmm. How much was that? 40. Don't write it down. Oh, don't. Only okay. if somebody asks. Okay. We're nuts. Sharon says, how do you accept payments? Hmm? Sharon says, how do you accept payments? It's listed on top of the live sale. Yeah. I take PayPal, Cash App, Venmo, and Zelle. And it's all listed on the live chat area. You, you will see all my information choose and pick which one you want to pay you can sell me it's really i love sales they don't charge me <laughs> oh my god everybody know my mouth is dry who's who's asking Mar margaret volsey says what is my shipping what did margaret get i think 17 dollars margaret yeah she she got the Cole handbag, $30. Mm -hmm. The Brighton bag, black mm -hmm. bag, $25. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it. Okay, $17. It goes in a priority box. You guys are not new to this. You guys are my people. $17, Vicky. Vintage sweater. Remy's looking at me like, Mom, we got to get up out of here. Vintage Italian sweater, almost like the one I'm wearing. 
The sweater is uh, $35 today and today only. These are sweaters that run for a, a whole lot of money. You can take out the shoulder pads on this. The workmanship is super cute. These are $35 for made in Italy. Vintage. You guys know how much vintage stuff goes. They are pretty pricey. But I'm bringing them for you next to nothing. Is this that has the vent? Super cute. These are mostly like one size fits everybody. All right. So I will show you guys those vintage pieces some other time. But um. We still have the heavy duty quilted jackets, guys. Now, this one's at $60, no, no less, super <laughs> heavy. Uh, who asked me for, for the Levi's jacket? I went back yesterday, they didn't have no more. They had one extra large, but you asked me for the large. Who was that Keisha. again? No, no, it wasn't Keisha. Oh, no, it was somebody, oh, what did Keisha say? Seventeen dollars for my shipping as well. Purse with sweater duster. Yes, seventeen dollars, Keisha. So this heavy duty ones. These are sixty dollars, and they are super heavy. Anyway, guys, so I tried to show you guys some ten dollar pieces, but and we can do, we can do that tomorrow, and uh, we do have. We do have. I have this. These are seven dollars. Nice. Was there a purple one? Jacket or sweater? Diana, do you mean sweater or jacket? Top. Vintage sweater you showed. Oh, vintage sweater? Mm -hmm. Okay. Purple. Purple, purple. Is that purple one? The heavy duty one? Oh. Is that sweater? Uh huh. It was a blue. I know you had asked me for a blue heavy duty one. It's not purple, but it's like blue. This sweater is too heavy for my taste, but it's this with the frills on the back. But I think I like this. It's like double breasted. I don't know if I have a purple. I have, I have this sweater. But it's kind of blue. It's not purple either. This is 35 for this sweater. That cardigan was 50. Any purple sweater? No. Maybe upstairs. I have a purple top. This super cute. This one is 25. I kept this in black. I don't have a purple. I don't think so. If I do, maybe it's gone. There's the black one that has purple in it. The black quilted. No purple. If you see a purple, you can always send me a screenshot and I can look for it. Because sometimes I don't know where I put stuff. So I was showing you guys this for $7. No, you showed a purple vintage item. Today or last time? <laughs> I don't know, girl. It's probably upstairs. I haven't really, let me look. I haven't released most of my my vintage pieces. Is You said it's a sweater? It's probably upstairs. 
is I don't see it down here. I showed you the purple blouse. I'm not a purple girl, so I don't know if I can uh, pick up a purple. So, all right, I don't see it. I don't see any purple. I don't see any purple. I don't remember. What somebody said to me? Jenny said, "Was it a purple and wine color, Diana?" Purple and wine. Or purple. purple or wine color. I don't know. I do have some sweaters upstairs, but I thought I will not keep it purple because purple is not my color. So I know I kept black. I cut I burgundy. I have burgundy. I just showed you the the sweater. Dana Smith said the purple you just showed. Oh. The blouse. This? This? The top. The top, yeah. Uh-huh. Remember I told you guys it sold. I only, I kept the black one. This is the only color that was left. This is super cute on. It just doesn't do it any justice. This is Anita Coulant, made in Italy. Yeah. How much did I say I was? this was going to go for? $25. Yeah. For this one, the lace. Did you want this? It's one size. It has a stretchy band on the waist. $25 is very stretchy. Look at that, on the waist area. So it fits. Okay. It's one size. One size. It is, let me see, made in Italy, it's one size, hand washed. It's one size, Diana. It will fit you. I don't know if you ever saw me try it on. It's one size. It's very stretchy right here. The, the lace itself gives, and then it has a stretchy band. It's $25 for this one. Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. Oh, let me show you guys. She said okay. Okay, Minnie. Mm -hmm. She wants it. Did you want it? Is it sold or? Oh, I wanted to show you guys this. This is Laundry by Sherry Siegel. I was going to keep this for myself, but I thought I was going to bring it to you guys before I rock it. This is an extra large yes. laundry, but oh, she says she wants it. Okay. Also, Miss Bossy says, hi, Miss Jackie. I'm just getting off. I'm glad I can catch your live. I miss seeing you. Oh, I miss seeing you too, Miss Bossy, but we're about to shut it down. So go and rewatch it and see. It was a lot of liquidation. So this is for Deanna Smith. Yay. One vintage sold. You guys need to buy these vintage pieces. Or else I'm just going to open me a vintage boutique. Ha! All right. I showed you guys the little cutesies. Those are $7 each. Black History Month is coming. Won't this look good? Sharon Williams says, where can I email my info for the bag? Oh, my email address is on top of the live chat.
my email, or you can just put it with your payment if you feel comfortable doing that. If you pay by Cash App or PayPal, just put your address on there. If you don't want to, you know, go through all the changes of emailing me, just put it on the how you paid. I have a whole set. There's the cuff. There's this necklace. There's the earring right here. The earring itself with the necklace is $24. She said you didn't, Miss Palsy said you got any light pink bags. Oh, yeah. Did you not see the Bagley Michigan ones? I'm going to show you. I know Remy's not happy with me right now. And this right here is $12. So, jewelry we have. All right, let me show you the pink bag. And then we can call it a day. I was showing you guys this Cheryl Sigel jacket. It's super cute. Cheryl Sigel for $25. If anybody wants it, it retails for... One fifty nine. I have an extra large and an extra small. The email's on top of the live chat. Huh? Sharon Williams said, "What's your email?" But it's on top of the live chat. It's on top of the live chat. Look at the live chat; you will see it. Look at the live chat; you will see my email. Miss Bossy, we have a uh, Bagley Mishka. Miss Bossy said light pink one on the chain. Wallet on the chain? Not regular bag? Light pink and a wallet on the chain. I don't think I have. Coming soon though. I do have this ones right here. I have red. I have a red wallet on the chain. I couldn't see which. red wallet on the chain i don't have pink it's sitting on the stand huh it's sitting on the stand that's Who's what she said pink yeah sitting on the stand this one i think that yeah this is a bottega dupe super cute very small very small it has a zipper and this is 24 dollars miss bossy yes. 24 if i close this down 24 dollars she wants it yay thank you miss bossy all right so guys i'm being clocked so i have to end this live sale next week we are going to do the new bags i'm not coming i might do a bean another bean of uh, liquidation bags i have a whole lot of new bags but this old bags got to get up out of here the ones the 20 dollar ones that we didn't sell i am donating those back but i'm leaving the 30 dollar ones and so i can make room for my new bags so if there's anything you saw in that $20 bean, $15 to $20 bean, just ask me if it's still available so that when they come to pick it up on Thursday, it would, you know, you have a chance. I still have, it's Valentine's week. I still have those CC studs, the, the CC studs, the stainless steel, and <coughs> the brooches. If anybody wants those, please ask for them. But as for now, we are going to shut it down.
that we did good for what it is. I didn't do a lot of new items today. I just wanted to get rid of some old items because when that truck gets here, my mind clicks. They're all going to get up out of here. So, even the $10 dresses I was trying to show you guys apparently ain't working. So, <laughs> they're going to have to go. But uh, if I might leave a couple of them for next time. I'm not sure. But anyway, guys, I appreciate you all. Is there anything else before I shut this down? To speak now, forever hold thy peace. Until next time. I put my pink back on. It got cold in here, guys. I had turned off the you fireplace. Said, is the brooches on sale? Oh, the brooches, the CC brooches. How much was I selling them? $14. They need to go. I have silver. I don't know if I have gold anymore. But yeah, that will be $14, Jeannie. Is that good for you? I mean, how many do I have? Oh no. Oh no. I have, <laughs> I have one silver and one gold. I forgot I've been selling, oh, two golds, one silver. And we still have the ankle bracelets. Summer is coming. I know those will be a seller for summertime. Yeah. So I only got three brooches left. Maybe four. I might have one upstairs. I'm not sure. But I only got three brooches left. It's so hard to get these things right now. The guy that gave it to me cannot get them anymore. No, mommy. Said gold. You want a gold? Okay. Yay. Gold for Miss Janine. Gold CC brooch for Miss Janine. With the crystals. Voila. $14. Okay. Yeah, I think they want to stay. So, guys. Miss Bossy and Diana were asking for their shipping. Miss Bossy, your shipping is ten dollars. Diana, your shipping is seventeen dollars. Cause you got two items. Seventeen dollars for you, and ten dollars for Miss Bossy. I was gonna put in an eight eight dollar box, but it's it's not padded. It's gonna your bag is gonna there's a hole is gonna go through. So we're gonna do it in the eleven dollar box. But so I'll just charge you ten dollars. We still have the CC earrings, guys. I say God, I know somebody had asked me, do you still have the CCs? Here they are. These are, right now, they're going to be $14. This thing has to go. And then the stainless steels, they used to be $24, but now $19. I have a lot of um, CC ones. I mean, that's silver. I don't think I have any gold. I have some GG gold ones and some Michael Kors. Oh, I do have this with the studs. Stainless steel, 19. So if you looking for a nice little Valentine's gift, why not? And then we got that one with the drop pearls, 19. No, those are 14, sorry. Oh my God, we're out. And then this used to be 24, the little hoops, stainless steel. But today... They are 19. Because I cannot... I keep coming in here looking. Guys, I've been wearing my store forever. And it's like every day I wear this. And it's still standing. But the gold is pretty much gone. And we got an MK. Stainless steel. 
Yep, Michael Kors. So guys, this is it. This is it. We are at the end of the sale. Oh, I got one. Voila, one gold. I didn't even think I had it anymore. I'll put this on the side. This is my number one seller right here. All right, guys. So, that's what we got today. I think, like, Janina, I think you said I'm going to get my mojo back. I think I am getting my mojo back because I felt like I was a little rusty there in the beginning. I was like, oh, my God, can I do this? But, yeah, we did. So, thank you, guys. If you have any questions, please email me. Please, please. Sharon Williams, my email address is on top of the live chat. It's J-A-C-K-E-T-R-U-M-A-N at ymail.com. Just Y. It's not Yahoo. Just Y. Yes. You guys have a good evening. I appreciate everybody. I haven't seen some of my sisters lately. I don't know if they don't get my notification. I haven't seen Suey. I haven't seen Gigi. I haven't seen... I haven't seen a lot of you all. So I hope all is well. And um, yeah, that's all I need to... I hope all is well. Now, thank you, Miss Bossy. I appreciate you. Thank you, Jeanine. Thank you, Miss Emma. Thank you, everybody. Oh, I didn't see Claudette either. I don't think she was here today. See, a lot of people did not even know that I was having a live sale. Sarah A and all the good, all my sisters, where they at? Where are my girls at? But anyway, I'll see you guys later. I appreciate you. Good night, Tracy. You made it because you're always going somewhere. Today, you made it till the end. Ha! Thank you. Thank you, Monica. Thank you, everybody. I'm like, oh, my God, Tracy didn't have plans today. Thank you, Vicky. I haven't seen Catherine Rector either. Hope all is well. And Don Jeffries, Ronald Jeffries for Don. I haven't seen anybody. But I hope everybody's well. And thank you, Miss Emma, for always supporting you, girl. Thank you. I appreciate you. And this is it. We're going to shut it down. This plane has landed. Carrier White. Didn't see her either. Hope all is well. So hopefully when I do my notification next week, they will be here. Thank you, Sassy. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I know, Tracy, you're laughing. It's true, but you're always on the go. Like, I got to go, people. <laughs> All right, Vicky. Thank you, guys. You guys have a good evening. I appreciate you. Janine, thank you for holding it down once more. Appreciate you. All right, guys. I'll see you mañana. I don't even know what I'm doing tomorrow, but we shall see. Ricardo, if you're still around... Be good. Thank you, Ricardo. <laughs> be a good man or good whoever. Ricardo be trying to give me a hard time. But anyway, hi guys. See you later. Bye. The plane has landed. Everybody has to leave. Take all your belongings and exit. Appreciate you guys. Love you. That's all I got for you today. Oh, thank you, Liz. Good night. Oh, you are. But that's okay. There's next week. I think I'll have one next week. I will. I need to get my mojo back. So I got to get all this stuff out of here. I know. We've been here since 2 o'clock, Liz. It's 2 to 4, and it's like 4.30 already. Yeah, the train has landed. But you can go watch my replay, Liz. And if you see anything, just email me. My email address is on top of the live chat. See if you can catch it before we... Um, Remy, you could put it again, right? Mm -hmm. Is it going to stay on mm. when we end the live sale? Yeah. <coughs> okay, oh, on the description box, yeah. All right. Don't forget your address, guys. I, I really need your address. If if there's anything you do, I need your address. I want to see here with your money and don't know what, what to do. All right. Good night, Liz. See you all next week.
All right. Bye, guys.